Hello, best friend, and welcome, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a fabulous day. If this is the first time you're watching my channel, my name is Sebastian, and I welcome you guys with open arms. I do pop culture videos every single day, so if you're looking for a new messy best friend, you have found me, grab a snack, grab a drink, hit that subscribe button, and yes, bitch, I am well aware, girl, this knockoff Louis Vuitton bucket hat, girl, I look a mess, so this will be the last time I wear it. I just don't like, I look like a, like a confused fisherman bitch trying to find like a mermaid i told the whole town that i saw a mermaid last tuesday nobody believes me so i'm out in the fucking wild in the fucking ocean trying to find one then a fucking whale's gonna fucking eat me and then i'm fucking pinocchio i feel like that i don't like it bitch but anyways how are you that was 47 seconds in and look at my little intro um yes grab a snack and a drink get comfortable because we have to talk so there is now okay so here's the thing you guys you know, I've always compared that, or I've always said that Hailey Bieber went to the school of Kris Jenner trying to, you know, tr Hailey Bieber, I, in my opinion, she literally, literally went to school of the Kris Jenner Harvard. She graduated valedictorian, bitch. She was voted um, a most mess, uh, you know, and she, in my opinion, is literally taking her career and trying to turn into, you know, Hailey but Jenner, you know, I, I really do see this like and, and it's so crazy that like until now people are catching up on this because she's just taking everything, in my opinion, that the Kardashians, Jenner have done and put it, you know, in her own way. And for example, like, you know, her promotional things for her makeup and her, her not her makeup, her, her skincare and stuff. It's like, Girl, what are you, I don't, we don't understand what you're selling, boo. Are you selling an OnlyFans link? Are you selling a product? Because a lot of it is just her body, which, you know, do you, boo? You know, I'm not, not shaming nobody. But if you're trying to sell a product, maybe show the product a little bit more than you. You know what I mean? Anyways, um, so there's this, so now, like, the, the word on the street is that Hailey Bieber is trying to come for the Kardashian, um, the card empire. That's the word I wanted to use. So it says here, is Hailey Bieber building an empire to rival the Kardashians? The model turned entrepreneur's road skincare line is going, is going great guns and she's eyeing fashion and even baby products next. She may be a self-confessed Nepo baby and the wife of Justin Bieber, but Hailey Bieber is determined to build a skincare brand that stands on its own. And she's considering adding baby products to Girl, what the fuck is she gonna baby product? Can you imagine her promoting a baby product, bitch? Girl, bye. Um, celebrities from Kim Kardashian and Kylie Jenner to John Legend and Gwen Stefani have all launched beauty brands with Jenner begging bagging 600 million uh, from Cody. Could Bieber be next? Hailey Bieber has grand plans for her skincare brand, Road. She's aiming to stand out in an increasingly crowded field of celebrity brands. She says, I want to be everywhere possible, said the fashion model to an entrepreneur. It just takes strategy and planning. I want to go into different territories and different places and to be able to have the inventory we need to do that. Um, there is so many, de I mean, there's definitely so many, you know, uh, celebrity brands. The thing is, the celebrity brands have to make sense. You know what I mean? Like, that's the only thing that, like, in my opinion, makes sense. But there's just some, some celebrity brands. I'm just like, girl, that is such a sad cash grab. Like, calm down, boo. You know? I think that once you are in the field, right, and once you already have a name and you already have like your brand i could definitely see you know getting into different territories i mean kylie has makeup and skin you know kim has skims and you know uh, makeup and skincare and perfumes i mean i think you 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 definitely should go into other fields but i also feel like you need to be able to like to 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 defend your product. You need to be able to like say, you know what, I know about this. Like you can tell when a celebrity is just selling something, you know, to sell. Like for example, you know, like I use this phone every day and I could not live without it. You know, you could tell whether or not a celebrity is there for their cash, for their checks, 
or for the passion behind it. And one thing I can tell you about Kim Kardashian is that I feel like Kim takes her time with her products. Kim didn't have all of this, you know, right away. I feel like Hailey Bieber has, and I think that's why she gets so much flack. Kylie Jenner was known for overlining her lips. She was known for her lips. She was known for, you know, going public about her having, you know, fillers or whatever. So it just made sense for her to come out with, you know, a lip gloss, a lipstick, a lip kit. So people, I think, turn on Hailey because they're like, girl, what, what background do you have of skincare? And now you're going to come out with baby products? Like, do you have a baby that you test out these products with? You know what I mean? So it's just those things. I feel like that's why she's, she's trying so hard, in my opinion, to just, you know, run on the runway and, and, and grab everything. You know, like those, those supermarket shows. I don't even know if they do them anymore. I, I just see clips on TikTok that they give you like 30 seconds to run into a supermarket and anything you can grab and put it in your in your cart, you get. So you like you go straight to the meats, you go straight to you know the most expensive thing. I mean, listen, if I got a one minute in a supermarket, I would go to Whole Foods, bitch. I know where all the bougie ass products are in Whole Foods, honey. Oh, I would make so much money. I would resell that shit. Are you kidding me? Um, so yeah, that's why I think Hailey Bieber just needs to chill. I think she needs to get some education first. You know, I think she needs to be known for something and and have the public want that from you, you know? Because Kim, you know, at least Kim with like her 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 undergarments, her body snatching things, Kim is known for, you know, her body. She's known for these tips and tricks that she's given in interviews. Haley doesn't. So, you know, a lot of people criticize her when she came out with the skincare and they were like, what, what, did you go to school? Like, did you learn about the skin? Like, how do you know about these things? You know what I mean? Like JLo with her skincare, she's known for her glow. So for some celebrities, it does make sense, but for some, it doesn't. And, you know, she wants to allegedly, you know, branch out and be everywhere. It just sounds hungry. It sounds like you just want money. It sounds like you just want popularity and fame. If I were Hailey Bieber, you know what I would do? Let's say, let's say I wanted to put out baby products. I'd wait until I was pregnant. I would, you know, I would wait until I was pregnant. I had the baby the first couple of years and said, look, the only thing that worked to, 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 um, to put to bed little Selena is, um, is this pillow. And I made my own version of it. You know what I mean? I had to invent a pillow for little Selena, you know, little Delina. Um, I would do that girl, you know, but now she's like, she's, I just doesn't make sense to me. And, and I feel like makeup or, or, you know, she, she has her, her, I, I mean, I don't need, the thing is, you don't know nothing about her. You don't know nothing about her. So you don't know what she's known for. You don't know what she's good at. You don't know what she's popular about. So that's the issue here, you guys. If she was better at being more open and being less about, you know, looking always picture perfect and aesthetically pleasing, I think she could easily um, try and, and, and with her fans sell a product that she is known for. For example, her, her smoothie at Air One, it, it actually, here at least in Los Angeles, I feel like everybody was drinking it. My actually, my a friend of mine, we were doing like a little photo shoot together for her, and she actually ordered us um, some some smoothies. She didn't tell me what it was, and then when when we got them, it was a Haley Bieber twenty dollar smoothie. Which I would not pay that, okay? Uh, and you know what? It was okay. I'm not gonna lie. It was I love coconut. It was like coconutty. So I feel like some things. Some things you can get away with, but like baby things or like, you know, it just doesn't make sense to me. So I feel like Haley, girl, listen, you already, you already have a name. You already have somewhat of a popularity thanks to, you know, the people around you, but make a name for yourself first. Let the public know who you are, you know, educate yourself, go to school, take some classes. You know what I mean? Those are the things I think she needs to be successful, but she has to stop counting on her marriage on her friends and on what the somewhat popularity she has educate yourself before you want to sell a product stop trying to be a kardashian stop leaning on the selena gomez drama find who you are and go sell that that's it you know what i mean and this is some free advice girl so you know i i usually i, I usually uh what is it i usually ask money for this advice honey 
Anyways, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I'd love to hear from you guys. Thank you, thank you so much for watching. You know, she could probably sell like Selena Gomez facts. You know, allegedly she's the president of the Selena Gomez fan club. No, I'm just kidding, bitch. Um, anyways, I love you all so much. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Mwah.